I remember my first day working at Penn Brewery, I was helping Rick out in the bottling shop, and Tom was like, oh, hey, Nick, grab one of those pens, uh, grab one of those pen Kaisers off the line, Kaiser pills, and try it. He's like, you'll probably really like it, being like fresh out of brewing school in an old home brewer. It's kind of a German IPA almost. So I cracked one, and I was like, oh, that's amazing. That's delicious. Took a case home with me, was giving it to people, and it slowly worked its way up to... Uh, up to a beer that, now that it's readily available, it's slowly gaining a following. It's still a bit of a cult following, but it's becoming a very, very popular beer. And it's a good, uh, good gateway beer into the, uh, the hoppy beer sector. It started being brewed here in the late 80s, right when the brewery first opened up. But it was a bit of a aggressively hopped beer. I don't think that the American public was ready for the aggressive hoppiness that Kaiser Pills has to the general palate. So I don't think Tom ever tried to push it out, just afraid that why dump all this money into this beer and so lose money on it. He would sell it out the back door. People would show up to buy it out of the back dock, friends of the brewery, people who knew about it. And um, they sold it with the, uh, like an upside down label from a different type of beer. So it had the government warning on it and everything. So it was legitimate, it was legally sold. And we, as the brewers, all like the beer. That's every, every one of us, that is our go-to beer. That's the beer we drink most often. I know. Team drink, Kaiser Club. Kaiser Club. Kaiser Club. Prost. Uh, I think when uh, Nick and Andy won the gold medal, in Denver, that was finally the point where they realized that, hey, we've got a winner on our hand. We've got a bunch of lunatics that like to show up on Friday evening, drink, toast, have a good time. Well, the way you get it into the Kaiser Club is by drinking with another member of the Kaiser Club, having a beer with, exactly, having a beer with another member of the Kaiser Club. So the Kaiser Club started with um, a few guys that will um, are here most every Friday, unless they have something going on. Um, kind of like a middle-aged guy happy hour. Kaiser Club is really uh, a group of folks that enjoy drinking beer, number one, and number two, enjoy the company of everybody that's part of the club. It takes me probably about 20 minutes to get into town, but it's a short 20 minutes when you know what's waiting for you here at the, at the brewery.